restaurant, fast food restaurant called Cookouts here in uh, Knoxville, Tennessee. They have like six locations here in the Knoxville area. Um, we're gonna go ahead and try it out. They got like hot dogs, burgers, chicken sandwiches. Uh, they got some barbecue. They got like a big variety of stuff to choose from. So we're gonna go in, try this great food out, and give you guys another idea of what us what a good local uh, restaurant, fast food restaurant is that is out there. You're welcome. Thank you. You say what now? Mm-hmm. Looks like that the tray is 539. Still isn't bad. Yeah, that's a good dig quite a bit. Is that what you want to do? That's what I'm gonna do. Something on the menu? Okay. I'll get the two hot dogs. You get the two hot dogs? I'll get the two hot dogs. That's what do you want. Did probably you want them? No, I'm, okay. gonna, I'm probably going to get the two quesadillas. Okay. And what do you want for sides? I might get the... You can get two. If you're ready, you can go ahead of us. Are you going to do the fries and the what? Yeah. Yeah, I'll probably do like the corn dog and the hush puppies. And then I'm just going to get a large drink. Yeah. Okay, I'll do the, the tray. I want to do the two hot dogs. Okay, what would you like on them? Uh, ketchup, mustard. Do you guys have onions? Yeah. Alright. You want both the same way? Yep. Perfect, and what's your two sides? And then I want the corn dog and the hush puppies. Mm -hmm. Chicken. Hi, Dr. Cup. And do you want a soda or a shake? Uh, just a soda. Perfect, anything else I can get for you? Nope, that'll be it. Five eighty nine for the year total. An hour straight. I Okay, your order number is going to be 3067, hold on to your receipt for me and take your food, okay? Alright, thank you. It looks to be about the same. <laughs>
Coke. Fanta. Is that right? That's mine. I'm 30, 67. <laughs> guys it's seen and right now we just got back uh to our hotel with our food from cookout and we're gonna show you guys what we got we each got the tray and the offer of the tray is that you get um a main course two sides and a drink so what i got was the two beef quesadillas with chicken nuggets and fries which i'm kind of disappointed with how many chicken nuggets I got, but oh well. It's what you get for paying like five something. It's like five and a half dollars. Five eighty nine. Mm hmm. But pretty basic. It actually looks pretty good. It does. And Joe, what did you get? Okay, so we got I got the same thing. I got the two hot dogs, so we can just open up this one. Bam! This the thing. I got the hush puppy, so I got four of those, and I got a corn dog. I think that corn dog and the fries are definitely something good that you can get. Um, but here's the hot dog that I got. That you got your choice of whatever toppings yeah, you it's wanted. Ba it's a basic hot dog. It's still probably going to be good. I got ketchup, mustard, and onion on it, so that's probably going to be pretty good. And we're going to go ahead and try this food. What do you want to do first? Uh, since it's me try first, since you have the camera. So this is the hot dog. I'm going to go ahead and give it a try. Uh, it's it's okay. This is a standard beef hot dog. For the price, it's good, but for just the hot dog itself, it's 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 an okay hot dog. Uh, I have a way I've had way better hot dogs than that. Um, now let's go ahead and try the corn dogs. Corn dog, corn dog is can't really, really not that really hard to mess up. So here we go. Mm-hmm. It tastes a lot like the corn dog that we get from the grocery store. Uh, you can just heat up in the microwave or bake or whatever. Well, it's good to get as a side, but as itself, it's again, it's, it's okay because it's like, it tastes a lot like what I get at the, at the grocery store. And then these, they call their hush puppies which I think is some like seafood thing. I'm not really sure. Usually they're like round. These are like cylinder. So let's go ahead and give these a try. I'm not a big fan of hush puppies, but I've had decent hush puppies, but they're, they're, oh, they're okay to me. These are all, these are, these are okay. I mean, I'm not, again, I'm not a big fan. Uh, they're just, they're basically like the same as everything else, just smaller, so. Oh no, this is good. I just um for the for the price you pay, you just gotta you gotta know what size to get in order to get your money's worth. So obviously, once you eat, start eating there more often, you'll know like what's good for the sides or whatnot. And this is just like one portion of their menu. They got a lot of other things you can eat. Yeah. All right. Let's try this quesadilla. Which you had your choice of chicken or beef. I got beef. That looks pretty good. Is it just like meat inside of it? 
meat and cheese. Mm. Is it good? It's good. Definitely wish there was more beef and cheese in it, but mm -hmm. again, you can't complain with the price. Oh, yeah. Let's try their fries. Look pretty Got a basic. Fry, are they? They look oh, like. They don't look too bad. Jack and a fry. Not bad. I like these fries. They're good. Mm-hmm. And then let's try a chicken nugget. Which they you gave you they give you three chicken nuggets? Yeah. That's weird. Yeah. I like I could see four, but this three is just odd. Yeah. They're basic like out of the bag nuggets. I'm not surprised. Nothing real special with it. What would you like comparing to? Um Mm, I mean, basic ones that you can buy at any store, but if we're talking a different restaurant, I would say like a Burger King type nugget. They're not. Yeah. Yeah. Anything they're good. For, they're they're good for the price because yeah. of the price. Otherwise, yeah. beyond that, they're just there's nothing really to them. Yeah. Yeah. But that's about it. Um. The price was good. The foods okay. I would have to rate this probably a. A seven, um, only because I'm not quite happy with side, with the sides, how much you get. Um, I like the price, but definitely um, was expecting a little bit more than what I thought, but that's my personal opinion. Mm -hmm. All right. So for me, I'm going to rate it a, a six just on this um, visit alone. I mean, it's probably... We probably could have a much better experience if we'd been there a couple of times. Yeah. But the place was seemed kind of small on the inside. Then again, we didn't eat there, but they also had seating outside. Yeah. It was kind of busy, so that means they must be doing something right. Um. The the tray is a good idea. You just need to know what size to pick to get um to get a decent amount. There's probably like probably about half of them are or at least one third are good to get. Cause you'll get a decent amount like you see the fries here and the corn dog which is a good price like i even said when we were walking out like if i was to do it again two corn dogs would actually be a would be pretty decent because i mean i eat two or yeah. three corn dogs as a meal by myself so that's yeah. actually pretty good for me um there was it was quite it was relatively fast for the food they had coke products um it, it looked quite clean from what i saw the beverage bar definitely needed to be clean oh yeah and they had something i think it was like tea in a pitcher so i'm not sure what was up with that yeah um they didn't have a big variety of like soda they had like four or five different ones so not a big variety so that's also a bummer um but yeah uh anything else to add um no but with the tray i could have gotten three quesadillas instead of two because that is an option for a side so yeah. you can do that and then get like fries or something it would be a good meal you so. could you could double you could double your tray instead of getting the sides yeah as well and you could get a shake which is a dollar which is a dollar more which is not too bad on that note uh please uh comment down below if you've ever eaten here what do you think about it we love to hear your thoughts on these places that we go and visit and we would love to hear your thoughts if you're going and it's your first time going to these places as well. Also, subscribe, like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter and Instagram. Uh, go to uh, patreon.com slash industrial burn heel. Support us there. All the money goes to help go into making more videos like this and our travels. And go to merch. This is a newer one that I have. Waffles abducting some chicken. And I got other new ones up and i got more coming out teespring.com slash industrial burn hill so head over there purchase purchase some merch post on social media that you are a fan and all that money that we make off those go towards helping our travels and bringing you more great videos so on that note i will see you later